Hi guys, and welcome to another episode of Among the Stars Celebrity Preview Review. So today, I'm extremely happy to be bringing you guys my review of Summer Rock Sweet Candy. So this perfume launched this year, 2016, and is technically the fourth slash fifth addition to Shakira's um, rock collection. So the box looks like this, and it is a bright neon pink, very similar design to the um, original with the star and the guitar, um, except for it's a hot pink one this time, and it says Summer Rock by Shakira, 30 milliliters, one ounce, and then it says Sweet Candy up here. There is no promo picture on these, um, just kind of a black back. It's got the Shakira logo on top, and then you've got the barcode and information on this. So this actually only comes out um, in a 30 mil, which kind of disappointed me because I really did want it. Um, it does have its counterpart, which is the Shakira Rock Fruity Vibes, which there will be a review on this channel um, next to this. So the bottle looks like this and is... Very, very, very similar in essence to the original Rocks. Um, it's actually the same bottle that the normal 30 mils come in. It just says Summer Rock by Shakira, and then it says Sweet Candy. I don't know if I can focus on that. Sweet Candy down down here. Um, in comparison to the original, like, Rocks, so here's Pop Rock and Sweet Candy. Um, the fluids are actually very similar in color. This is supposed to be, like, a hot pink. Um, I really wish this cap would have been on there. I don't even know if this cap would fit on. I don't know. I just think that they should have done a smaller rock cap, but that's just my personal opinion. Um, I just don't like this plain clear cap like that. Just personal opinion is what it is. So the notes for Sweet Candy um, Summer Rock are top notes are lemon sorbet, black ras blackberry, and raspberry. Middle notes are magnolia, and the base notes are wood and musk. Um, I'm not going to lie when I tell you guys that this perfume reminds me of two other fragrances. One, it reminds me of S.E. Floral, which is the pink, rosy colored one um, from Shakira's original line from the S line. And it also reminds me of Philosophy's Falling in Love, um, if you know what either one of those smells like. When you first spray it, I will say the fragrance doesn't change a whole lot. It changes a little bit, but not a lot, a lot. Um, when you first spray it, you definitely get the blackberry, the raspberry. Um, you definitely get a little bit of the magnolia floralness. Um, and rounding off the base, you get a little bit of the musk and a little bit of the wood. It isn't super musky. It isn't super woody. I'm definitely getting, like, the blackberry, the raspberry, and the magnolia. Um, very much like... Uh, falling in love more than S.E. Floral. It's very similar to S.E. Floral, but S.E. Floral and Falling in Love are very similar as well. Um, very much almost like a sugared blackberries with musk and wood is definitely what I'm getting from this with a little bit of magnolia from it. Um, do I see it being sweet candy? Yes and no. I almost could see it as like a blackberry candy. Um, but it isn't, like, super, super potent. Um, these both are Eau de Toilette, as most um, Shakira fragrances are. Um, lasting power, it lasts about four hours. I mean, it wasn't too terribly strong. Um, I actually got these sent to me from a friend in Brazil, which, thank you to them. Um, but I will say, one, I wish these would have come in 80 mils, just because I would have liked the bottles to be bigger, just so they matched everything else I was doing. Um, with, you know, having all the bottles the same size. Um, but this one, honestly, isn't really much different from Essie Floral. And I know that it is currently available on eBay for, like, $125 plus a shit ton of money for shipping. And definitely not worth that money, in my opinion. Um, it's just, the money that they want for one bottle is ridiculous, and especially for only being a 30 mil, um, I'll be surprised if they even sell any of them. So, there is, you know, and la I forgot to tell you guys, lasting power, like I said, is about four hours. I definitely think this is more of a spring summer scent. Um, definitely can see the summer rock where it's coming from. Um, 
but I almost wish that they would have combined these two as one and just called it Summer Rock. Um, or I know that when the original plan for this came out that these were, this it was going to be called Fruity Rock. Um, but I kind of like that they just they made them two separate fragrances. Um, but definitely don't think this one is too far different from Estee Floral to spend a crap ton of money on. Will they come to the United States at some point? Hopefully. Um, I don't think we'll ever see them mass market in the United States because Shakira fragrances don't do that anymore. Um, but definitely they'll show up on eBay hopefully and we'll get them a little bit more um, and as the future comes. So there you guys go. There is my review of Shakira's Summer Rock Sweet Candy. As always guys, thanks so much for watching. Follow me on Twitter, A the S Perfume, and Instagram, Among the Stars Perfume. Links are in the description below. And as always guys, thanks so much for watching. Bye.